all cow's milk contains either A1 or A2 protein. So the, each cow, so the the, the uh, milk contains uh, one gene from the father, one gene from the mother. So there's an A, an A1 or an A2 gene comes from both sides. So so each cow is one of three things. Its 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 makeup is it's A1 A1, A1 A2, or A2 A2. And it's the A2A2 cows that produce the, the purely A2 milk that's more easy to digest. So some people who have a problem with drinking milk might be that the problem is to do with the protein aspect of milk. So some people, the people who are lactose intolerant, everybody knows about that, that's to do with the sugar side of the milk. But the A2 milk is to do with people who, have got, who are protein intolerant. So the, because the A1 protein is very difficult to digest, some people that causes them to have um, upset stomach, bloatedness, or it can even cause eczema. So um, by swapping onto A2 milk, that's more easy to digest. Some of those people could drink, go back to drinking cow's milk if they, but they might currently uh, be avoiding cow's milk and drinking an alternative like soy milk. The uh, because um, because I've I've been a dairy farmer for 30 years now, and I've seen the highs and lows of dairy farming, and it's a bit of a roller coaster ride, and you have to take the rough with the smooth. And I just thought that if we could produce more of a niche market product that might give us some uh, stability and some insulation from the very uh, deep troughs that dairy farming finds itself in, uh, particularly in the last three years. So I felt that uh, it was important to try and differentiate ourselves from just producing uh, the normal uh, everyday milk that everybody else produces. So A2 milk is actually available in all kinds of different supermarkets. So it's in Tesco's, Sainsbury's, Morrison's, uh, Waitrose. It's in Harrods as well. But it's not in every branch, every branch of every supermarket. So it's only it's only in certain ones. So uh, some some people, uh, if the people who've got a problem and they find that A2 milk is better for them, if they speak to their dairy counter manager in the local supermarket, it's quite possible that they'll start getting it in for them if they know that there's a demand for it. Um, the A2 milk company that we that we supply have, have done a massive amount to try and um, raise the awareness of uh, the A2 milk is there and it, it may be of benefit to people. So there's a huge online presence and um, it's, it's targeting different groups like Mums Net and um, people who do uh, food blogging and these sorts of things. So uh, for every convert to A2 milk then hopefully that message spreads a little bit wider and eventually those ripples in the pond will get bigger and bigger and everybody will eventually become aware of it.